What was Simpson Street like growing up? I mean, we we always hear about, you know, or we see the pictures on the roof and the pictures on the stoop. What was the street like? What other were there lots of houses on the street? Uh, there were apartment buildings. There were no single family houses. Uh, Simpson Street ran for several consecutive blocks and this particular one, mm. half of the block was covered by an elementary school. There was a five and 10 or a five and dime as they were called, <laughs> Kresge's, yeah. which was a very big store. Um, we were very lucky to have three bakeries within walking distance. So you wonder why wow. I love sweets. Uh, <laughs> Horn, Horn and Hard Arts, which was well known, and Cushman's and a Jewish Bakery, all within a block of each other. Did you go to that elementary school that was on your street? Yes, it was public school 20. Hmm. And did yeah. you, do you remember and, having feelings about the police precinct there? Like, did it make you feel extra safe on your street? Or did you, how did you feel about the police being on your block? Uh, they were not kind to the boys who played stickball. For some reason, they found it necessary to take their bats and break them. Uh, yeah, so that history of antagonism goes back quite a ways, even if it's not as overt as it may be today. I don't know where or what neighborhoods the police came from. They weren't the suburbs that exist like they do today, but they were clearly not from the South Bronx. Mm. 